Hello my friend, this is Sophia from SophiaOja.com. In this video, I would like to show you how to set up an exit intent form or a pop-up form on your Squarespace website. Alright, so here I am on my home page and I have a pop-up that should pop up as I scroll 50% into the page and there it is. So this is a ConvertKit form and I have set it up so that it only shows up on my home page and on my blog page. So let me show you how to set that up. Jump into your ConvertKit account and create a form. Here for instance I have created a form and under settings I want to show you something. You go under style and I, I would recommend a minimal that looks the best uh, when you have a pop-up or a exit intent form in my opinion this one looks the, the best and then click modal uh, you can also click slide in if you wanted to slide in on the page but for this purpose I'm selecting modal and again here you have some choices it can be an exit intent so it shows up when somebody is about to leave the page or a scroll percentage so if they've scrolled a certain percentage of your page then this form will pop up and I like to keep it at 50% you can keep it at 70% all right and then one thing that's important is you're going to change this to 15 days that's the recommended number of days that uh, is con is recommended by ConvertKit. So in other words, for the next 15 days, the same visitor will not be shown the form again. For our demonstration purposes for this video, I'm going to leave it at zero days so that we can see the results of our work when I show you the, in the in the tests. So I'm going to leave it at zero, but make sure you change this to 15 or 30, however you want it to be, and click Save Form. Then jump into embed, go into JavaScript, command C to copy if you're on a Mac, and then jump inside of your Squarespace account. So you would go directly into the page that you want this form to show up. So I would like to select my about page today. And so I'm here on my about page. And what you need to do is find a spot where you're going to paste this code. Now make sure that it's on the page itself and not in the footer or the pre-footer. Okay, because that's going to affect your entire site. Uh, the form can then show up on all your pages. If you want it just on your about page or, or you select which page you want it to be on, find a spot. I'm going to choose at the very bottom of this page, select code, and then paste in that form script here. Click apply. Oh, what happened here? There it is. And then save. So now when I go to my about page, or my about page. <laughs> and I scroll down this page, this should pop up. There it is. All right. So I hope that this is helpful. Very easy to set this up. Just make sure that you're not putting it into the footer or the pre footer of your page, but at the very bottom of the of the page only. Okay, um, I hope this is helpful. I wish you all the best. Have fun with exits, forms, and pop-ups on your site. Bye.